Hi here, Sam from Woodbridge Garden Rooms. Um, so we're building a sit panel garden room um, at the moment. Um, so as you can see, we've got the last panel here um, off the roof. Three panels already on. Uh, I've had a few requests to ask for um, how we do the roof. Um, I thought if we make the last panel, it sort of makes it a bit quicker for you. So. Um, every panel is the same pretty much um, so we've built the walls um, there's a few I'll, have a, I'll give, give you a quick walk round this one's got a 600 millimetre canopy on the front hence the reason the bits of timber are sticking out large window looking across the field little window at the back and then there's a sliding door with a, a normal opening door. Um, so once the walls are built, these timbers go on here to make the full. It starts at 50 mil, goes all the way down to nothing at that end. That creates the full for the water front to back. Um, so we've got three panels on the roof at the moment. They've been lifted up. Um, what you need to do is put your timbers in first and then lift them up, they're quite heavy. These are 150mm sit panels, so this one's pretty much ready to go, we just need to glue in there. So this bit will sit into that timber up there, and we'll lift it up now and show you how to connect it. So as you can see, the last one needs to be lifted on the outside, so it's a bit more work. Um, but once they're on and connected, the Tom will go up there now and knock them together and then 
this joint here will start closing up. So that's where the, the panel slips onto the timber that's already there. And then you literally got the canopy here which will put OSB board on the top and bottom and that allows down lights to be put in there. This one incidentally has got a, uh, a canopy out this side as well um, but we'll add those timbers on with brackets as it's not low, really load bearing it's not necessary to add the, the timbers going that way. Um, but yeah any questions, just let me know.